today, it's Daniel H. And once again, I'm back behind the wheel of what is definitely a supercar. I am in an Audi R8 2008, and it's an absolute beast. Wow, we're in Woodside, California. There's a lot of car culture out here. And uh, our good friend and bat member David has asked me to bring this Audi R8 to bring a trailer. So we're out on a test drive and checking it out and we just got our first taste of what it can do. driving an Audi R8 that was purchased in Germany. It's a one owner car. It's like it's brand new for one. It smells like rich leather on the inside and it's absolutely incredibly different than anything I've ever driven before. It is a rocket ship. like a Hemi Cuda. I mean, it's just endless power, super exciting to drive, sticks to the road like a glue trap. This has got to be one of the top 10 cars I've ever driven. I've driven over 2,000 cars. I've been looking at cars my whole life and man, I feel so lucky to have gotten to use this car for an hour today. Listen to this thing. I'm going to be quiet for a while. It's going to take some time to get used to a car as good as this car because to figure out exactly where and how it's shifting is something for a connoisseur, it's something for an individual that loves driving cars. And I love driving cars and this is like nothing I've ever felt before. It's got so much power, it's, it's bottomless power. I mean, I can't explain how hard the power comes on. It feels like if you were riding a horse, all of a sudden you gave it a whipping and it just took off like a rocket ship. She sings. She sings the most beautiful song. Do you feel that thing? It's like the transmission has a stall. It feels like an old school 600 horsepower Camaro with a turbo 350 and a stall converter. And when you hit it, the thing just rears back on its haunches and takes off like an absolute banshee. This is an incredible car. I'm so thankful now that David let us take it. It's buttery. It doesn't even squeal the tires. I mean, we just hit a 15 mile an hour turn at 45 miles an hour. And this car just eats up the turns. It's eating up the turns. They must have put a lot of time into figuring out where these seats should be in this car because it couldn't be better. I'm super comfortable and I'm right on top of the steering wheel where I like to be. 